Hey guys, what's up? So today I am back with another video. It's about a week until Christmas. Super excited, so I'm in my Christmas sweater and I'm just gonna be showing you guys my vinyl collection. Half of it is like Christmas records, so I thought this would be the appropriate time to film this. If you guys enjoy it, make sure to subscribe down below and let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so starting off, I have a Crosley record player in the color blue. Um, and I heard a lot of bad reviews about this um, brand and I have not had any problems with it after having it for two years. So I guess I would say that I recommend it. I feel like it's a really good record player and it was about like $65 I think, so not too bad at all. So with this collection, it's very like half and half. Half of them are like really vintage records from either a uh, record store or they are from an antique store or a thrift store, that section, or they're like very new and very recent. So we have two opposite ends of the spectrum. So to keep things interesting, I'm gonna ba bounce back and forth from the different types. Okay, so I thought I would start out with one of my favorite Christmas records and that is the Beach Boys Christmas album. Uh, this is including Little Saint Nick, Man With All The Toys, Merry Christmas Baby, this album. And it has this really cute vintage photo on the back of them with it signed. It just says, we'd like to wish you a Merry Christmas. This one we got at a record store and it was $9.99. So not too bad. And this next one is from the band Lovely The Band. They are one of my favorite artists. And this album is so fun. Like look at all these photos. I loved looking through all these. I got this one at Amoeba Records in LA and it has two parts to it. There are two different um, vinyls in here, but I love this album. One of my favorite bands. If you haven't listened to them, everyone knows the song Broken, but they have a lot of other really great songs. Check it out. All right, next is Bing Crosby, super classic. I love this one. The picture on it is so cute. And um, this is what it looks like. So it has this red side and then this, whoop, this black side. On the back is just a photo of him and a little like bio thing right here. And then this song. So there's two sides to it, just one record. I don't remember where I got this one from, but it is a favorite. Okay, next one, super basic, but my all-time favorite artist is Shawn Mendes, and I love this album so much. So this is probably my favorite vinyl record that I own. Oh, so it has like this tan kind of beige color in the middle, and um, it's two-sided, only one. And then on the inside, it came with this like lyric sheet that's really pretty with, I just love the um, floral like branding to this album. So this is what the back looks like. It has the pretty floral branding on it. And this is an amazing album. I got this one as a Christmas gift, so I don't know where it's from, but it's sold tons of places. Love it. Okay, this one is a Merry Christmas Carols from Disneyland. I did not purchase it there. This is really old. I don't know where we got this one from. I believe it was a thrift store, but this one has um, all the lyrics on the back of all the songs. There are two sides to it, super cute, and I love hearing the Disney characters sing the Christmas songs. And it is like this. Focus, okay. So it's yellow and it says Disneyland on it. Super classic and just like so adorable. I love this one and it's just like so festive to listen to. Okay, and then the next newer one is the soundtrack of La La Land, one of my favorite movies. Um, if you have not seen this one, I'm pretty sure everyone has, but if you have not, must see. Um, this one just looks like this and it is so fun and so cute. This is what the back looks like and the front has a cute picture of me and Sebastian. Um, definitely recommend, I believe we got this one on Amazon. It was not too expensive, but yes, this one is amazing. Then we got another Bing Crosby one and this one includes Rosemary Clooney and this one is super cute. I love this cover. This one was only 99 cents at a thrift store. This one was a great find. It has two different sides. One side is Bing Crosby, the other is Rosemary. And so we have, it is green, super cute. And all of these are classics. We got White Christmas, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, Way in a Manger, Christmas Song, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. Just all the classic Christmas songs that we know and love. Okay, this next one, judge me all you want, but High School Musical is my favorite movie personally, like out of every movie, favorite movie right here. So I had to get the soundtrack. This one is from Urban Outfitters and it has this cute photo of Troy and Gabriella from the New Year's scene in the beginning. And it has all of the soundtrack from the first movie. So it's just the first movie. 
and it said when I got it, it was going to be gold and it's this weird yellow color. I mean, it's kind of fun and different, but I'm not a huge fan of the yellow color, but yeah, so if you edit it, if you want to take a picture of it, it, it could look gold, but it, it's really not gold. So yeah, but um, it has all of the best. The, the first one's personally my favorite movie out of all of them. I know lots of people like the second one as their first as their favorite, but the first one is my favorite, so I had to get this one with the classic iconic jumping picture. Like, come on. Okay, this one we got at thrift store for 99 cents. It is Carousel, and this is a soundtrack I have never listened to. I just use it. I used it as decor in my room for a long time because I love this like rainbowy color and. I I should probably listen to it at least once, but it's really cute. Like, look at the back. It's really cute. I believe this is a movie. Yes, it is a movie, Carousel. I've never seen it, but I thought the record inside was really cute to display. Okay, next is Van Stroy Nation of Two's album. This is also one of those cool like open flap ones and he has these hand-drawn photos that I just love. And so this is what the record looks like inside um it has two flaps but there's only one vinyl in there and all of the titles are handwritten and all the lyrics are handwritten on this lyric sheet i think this is really really cool so it has little hand-drawn photos and pic or little hand-drawn pictures and all of the lyrics are handwritten. It's really hard to read, but it, I think it's just like so cool. Like Saturday Sun up here has like a sun and people and it's like all super personalized because he did it all himself. So I feel like this is like one of my favorite ones because it's so like different from what you've seen in other ones. It's not just like an Urban Outfitters one that you just get. It's really like personalized. So I love this one. And no, I did not just get this because of Riptide. It's not even on here. I swear, everyone thinks of Vanster, they think of Riptide. I'm like, come on, there are so many other songs that are great. It's not just Riptide, so yeah. Okay, this next one I actually have not listened to just because I don't know if I really want to, but I got it for a display and it is Treasure Island of, um, of Disneyland, sorry. Treasure Island from Walt Disney that they have at Disneyland. And it's actually kind of cool. It's like a little like book almost. So they have really old like hand-drawn photos and it's kind of cool, but I mean, I just got it to display it. I didn't get it to like listen to, so it's kind of weird like in gunshots and pirates and stuff. But this is also that classic like iconic yellow Disneyland uh, label on here. And then I have the soundtrack of The Greatest Showman, also another one of my favorite movies of all time. I love this movie. So it looks like this. It just has black and then it says The Greatest Showman in the gold and it's two-sided and the back has Hugh Jackman and the like iconic costume. And this just has all the soundtrack of it pretty much. And it came with this lyric sheet that is really cool. So it opens up, it has some really cool photos in it. And then Zac Efron and Zendaya, love that. love that scene, love that song, love that movie, everything. Got Lauren Aldred and Kiala Settle on the back. So it's really cool. I feel like this one's really creative and honestly one of my favorite movies. Okay, so this next one is a 10 box set. So there's 10 in here, they're all red, they're really cool, of Broadway in stereo, so Broadway hits. Um, I'm really into musical theater, and so I thought this would be really, really fun to have, and it was literally only 99 cents for 10 of these, and it came in this big box. So, oh, it's kind of dusty. So, oh, they all look like this. They all look the same. And the shows that are on here are My Fair Lady, Oklahoma, South Pacific, Sound of Music, Showboat, State Fair, Flower Drum Song, Gigi, Mary, Widow, Can Can, and Porgy and Bess. I don't know all of these. I just, it was 99 cents for all of them and I thought that was a really good deal. And it has a lot of cool ones on here. So I have not listened to all of these. I probably should, but I have to get around to that. And this one is newer, but it's also older. So this is the Peanuts Greatest Hits. Um, and I thought this one is really cute. It looks like this. So it has Charlie Brown on the front and then Lucy on the back. And it just has like all the classic songs that you would know from them. Has this super cute 
and then here's like Charlie Brown's Jazz Roots. So it gives this whole like story on the back I thought was cool. And then there's two sides to it. It has Linus and Lucy, Charlie Brown theme, baseball theme, Oh Good Grief. Just some of those ones. One of my favorite is skating and Christmas time is here. So it has like all different ones from all the movies and classic ones. So it's newer, but it's older at the same time. I'm just gonna go through these last ones pretty quickly, but this one is Chipmunk's Christmas. <laughs> this one is really funny to listen to. It's like so high pitched, can get kind of annoying, but it's also really cute. So this is like so adorable. Like, so Alvin, Simon, and Theodore with David's, yeah, David Seville. So it's pretty funny. This one I honestly bought because I needed 99 more cents or like a dollar or something at a thrift store so they wouldn't charge my card like $5 or something. So I just got this one. I have not listened to it. It's Orange Admiral, a uh, generation of new sound. It's really old. Um, I have no idea what any of these songs are, um, but yeah, it's a cool cover. This one is from Rockaway Records, The Brightest Stars of Christmas. It has Elvis Presley, Julie Andrews. Um, just, those are the only ones I really recognize. There's a bunch of other names on here, but they are a bunch of Christmas artists. Christmas artists. These are just a bunch of Christmas songs that are iconic. Jingle Bells, Joy to the World, Sleigh Ride, Silent Night. So each artist sings a different song. There are two sides to it and it looks like this, it's blue. This one was 99 cents. It is Grimm's Fairy Tales and I believe, I haven't listened to this one. Yeah, it's yellow and I believe it is not music. It is a like audio type thing where it's uh, storytelling. So, I mean, that's cool. It has a bunch of stories on here, Snow White's on here, Rumpelstiltskin, the fox and the geese. So there's a few stories, I have not listened to it, but I thought it was cool to display, so I got the yellow. And then this last one is Christmas with Fred Waring and the Pennsylvanians. So it looks like this, orangey, yellow, two-sided. And this one, I believe we got at either Goodwill or Salvation Army, one of those. Just, I love to have these Christmas ones. Yeah, 99 cents. Oh, and Christmas with Nat King Cole, another classic. And then real quick, I do have these mini ones from an antique store I went to. So I got this Disneyland one that has the three kinds of pig houses and the three little pig story. Then this one is from Dot Records and I have no idea what it is. I just got it for display. Uh, Bring it on home, Joe Stampley and you make life easy, Joe Stampley. This one I got at a antique store and it is the Beatles, I Wanna Hold Your Hand, and I saw her standing there. Super cute, it doesn't actually like work. I think it's just because it's really old, but. So yeah, that was my entire vinyl collection. I keep them all in this um, basket. Oh, I keep them all in this basket from Michael's, or this isn't a basket, this is a crate. I keep them in this crate from Michael's, it's white, and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe down below and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.